Well, welcome back to the slowest growing channel and the least watched channel on both Twitch and YouTube. Don't forget you can always follow. Check the Bobby section and follow me here on you know YouTube, Twitch, or whatever with the link tree. But let's do a little bit more Spider-Man. Miles, club fair, remember? You on your way? Oh right, that's the day. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. You can afford it. And I heard he's talking scholarships. Have oh, so that's many nice. questions for him. Be there soon. Brooklyn Visions or not. Passing through. Where is it at though? I don't know which way we're supposed to go, but whatever. Ooh. We. Trying to see where we have to go because it's not really telling us. Ooh, what's this? I forgot. Prowler stash. Oh, man, that's difficult. Brooklyn Visions. I wonder why it's not giving me, telling me exactly where we have to go, though. We have no skills, so I don't know why it's doing that. We. Eventually, it's going to have to... Does anyone know where we have to go? I mean, I don't mind just doing it this way. Ooh, what's this? Oh, yes, yeah, right. But we can't do that. We suck at it. City seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee. Or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. There we go, healing the world. Hey Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? I'm sure. I'm excited Why not? to see what you're up to. Great. We I'm excited to show you. You better oh, be Dookie Ho. Let's call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got right now. with Harry and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Wee. Well, how many people, if you had superpowers, would actually use it to help people instead of, you know, I mean, seriously, considering how they would turn on you in a heartbeat. Everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but <clears throat> there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. Ah, uh, well. If you're free, they could really use We're your not. webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Yeah, why not? Those people Whee! are trying to burn down a building! The longer you stay in there, the more this is going to Look at these douches. You know these douche nozzles. Ow. No, let Duke if you move, man. Ow. Stop shooting, man. Ow, ow. Well, we can't get him to. Why is this all of a sudden like 50 times harder? Get down. 
Beat that ass, beat that ass, or his ass. Oh, come on, man, you're hitting him. Move then, if you don't want to fight the guy. Fight him, he can't be that impossible for you. Better put out the fires. Why is he, why is he like... <laughs> I mean, I can't be that bad. Can I? Probably so. It's not like anybody watches anyways. But we'll leave it that way. I mean, it's just... I hate to make it that easy, but... Seems like no matter what, he loses health way too fast. Get off, Dookie! Okay. You can't get him to do that. You can't use... No, Dookie! I thought he had web shooters, you know, you could shoot. Screw it, we're just gonna leave. Because I figured, you know, you use the web shooters, but he's not even doing that. I wish I had time to help, but I'm needed somewhere else. Well, maybe if you use your web shooters like you, uh, like we were able to in other times. Let me see something. Watch this. See, now he's doing it, see? See, I'm hitting the same buttons. Now he's able to do it. I like how when you don't need him to so, do it, he can, to you know he can do it when you don't need him to. <laughs> to send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with uh, everything. I'll call him right now. But... Don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. I like hey, this MJ. You know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. Oh, especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. This version, this version of MJ is better than the one in that movie with Tobey Maguire. I mean, the actress is good though. Don't get me wrong. But this one's far more understanding. There you go. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Emily's tree. Oh, this is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> uh oh. So, what do you think? A far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Uh. Let him... Aside for himself. Uh, sorry. All right. 
This actually is a pretty good game you know, though. Seeing you boys together again. Right then. <sighs> Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. <laughs> Shouldn't you have it where everybody can see it? So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment. But when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool Insects. research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. A carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Sure. Bee drone. <laughs> Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were trained to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better yeah. you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves to stop them. <laughs> oh, nice! Oh, thank you. Yes! Yep! Let's... Trying to hide behind a leaf. Little dookie hoe. Oh, yeah! Gotta protect the hive! With my bees, I know they do it. Nice or bees. Gotcha. Yay, that was fun. A very productive session. We got, we got great data. Dr. Okay. Washington, well, I know. your lab supplies have arrived. Welcome to Oh, they got a PlayStation controller. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real. You'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Yeah, make Thanks some babies. Up. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. He's overly excited. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you the please. one arm front. Uh, Man. Any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc. This is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains. Anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I've never been better. 
That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. That lizard. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Emily May Foundation. I wonder how long this place is gonna last. Where do I even start? You're asking the wrong person, Dickie Hill. Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Huh? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. I know. Complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Make sure everything down there is done. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of a successful outcome. Here at the Emily May Foundation, this cutting edge work is being put to use saving lives. Emily May Foundation. Nice lab. I wish I could work at a place What's like this? this. Some kind of radiation. I have a real there? job for a change. I, if this is what I got a degree in molecular for. biology and biochemistry, and keep using my degree. Happens when you work yeah. at a fifth-rate right. college. Whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Excuse me. There's so much to explore. But I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. No, you shouldn't. There is a lot to explore, but you walk so slow. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think <sighs> back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. 
Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? Good news, the... You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. So calming, and that we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for understanding. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test map? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize no, no. optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. You say so. Let's see. Interesting. You say so. This is annoying. <coughs> I don't like doing stuff like this because you can't. Because everything looks like that's where it would go, but then when you try to... <coughs> well... <coughs> that would have made more sense. Oh, I see the white thing in my jigs. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Oh no, right. no, 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 no. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Well, you do still gotta make money somehow. Yeah, I pay for this stuff. Okay, if I combine these traits. Yeah, you think I could do that, huh? One step closer to Oh forward. no. Nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on. But could you look at one more gene for me? Curious no. to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Okay. I don't work. Let's see what this worked though. Nope. these things yeah. 
See, that looks like that would work, but. If you could, can you? Get it. Not real good at these things. What the hell you did this wrong here for? Shoot. I don't have a clue. Hope this will be the last one because damn, these things are hard. Did I have this here before though? So you think this is it, but beautiful work, Peter. Good. Talk to the guest star for the other area. Please be the, la the last one. No more, please. Using this technology, we're on track to Because I suck at this stuff. Wow. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. <laughs> Impressive, but not show-offy. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. <laughs> nope, false alarm. Right here. Please remember that Monday is a holiday and the office Go ahead. Is Swipe. Swipe. Wow. Pizza. Man, Harry, this is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just things are really hectic right now. Oh, yeah, somebody's gonna. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was I think I've seen this I part if I survived. And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that Aww. our planet is in trouble. For as a preview it's my to the game. I think there's gonna be a fight. I might be wrong though, I'm an idiot anyways. A loser. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> <laughs> You're all happy. That's when disaster strikes.
I wonder when Venom shows up. Oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the locations, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Thank you. Hey. Bad guys on the hey, block. Sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but... duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Stop, please. Ah! I knew he was going to over do that. I'm still watching the deal. I knew he was going to overdo that. Okay, as soon as you're ready. Webcam wonder travel the web literally. Ah, uh, probably not. Let's see if we can knock out some side stuff. What's this, though? Oh, I see. Let's do that, though. We're not going to do any more side, any more missions. We're going to do some side stuff. I know we have one skill point, but I don't think there's anything we can get with that skill What's thing. What's up, Danicasters? I've seen the questions about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? Well, big picture. It's an Oscorp spinoff, which we don't love, I know, but the man in charge, Harry Osborne, has got a decent rep. At the very least, he hired my favorite bee scientist, aka apiologist, Dr. M. Young. They're the foremost expert on colony collapse disorder and a pretty sick ukulele player if you happen to follow them on the socials. They better like being in that picture against their will. You know, I saw an old Grand Master playing there last week. Anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who lives down the street from me. Dead. <laughs> Never seen anything like this. That's sad. I don't compete against people because I will lose. So you gotta be careful not to get too close to that mission, or otherwise, yeah, let's do this real quick. Just in case. This way, you know, if we accidentally get too far, that won't matter. What the heck? Damn, so I wanna actually paint it that. That's pretty good, though. Wee. There you go. Hopefully we can do it this time. Watch Dookie. Those people are trying to burn down a building. So what Dookies do? Oh, seriously. Move, 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 move. Ow! Damn, he still gets his ass whooped. Yeah, he still gets his ass whooped. Jeez. Right back. Damn, if we could get him to move. Can you imagine him moving out of the way when you... Better put out the fires. Oh, he's doing it this time. 
Okay, what was with those people? Almost sounded like they were part of a cult. The douchebags. Oh, we got more of that now. That should be enough, though, to get. How many do we have? Two. Oh, heck yeah. What is the highest level we can get in this game? Wee. A sand crystal. More Marco memories scattered all over New York. Oh shh. Sorry, I forgot about that. And I don't even know where to start. Ooh, beat those anos. Move, move. Bye, Sanduki. Stop. Don't be scared. Ah, the larger. I have to beat your ass to continue this side mission. Now to see what's inside the crystal. <laughs> Maybe I'm being paranoid, but everywhere I go, I see them too. Work, the corner store, in the park. <laughs> They're tracking us. Marco made a lot of enemies. Wonder if they finally caught up to him. Seems like it did. What are these tokens for? Oops. Go ahead and save this. Yay. And, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for today, for now. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, watch my other videos, check out the Batman section, follow those links, follow me here, Twitch, YouTube, all other stuff. That isn't like a dragon that I would normally play on a Sunday. On a Sunday, I'm going to do that Wednesday because I took Thursday, Friday off. We'll do that. Then, so thanks for watching. But let's upload this sucker. Thanks for watching. Auf Wiedersehen.